Today, I'm gonna to tell you a little bit about what a jackfruit is and how to make your own pulled pork barbecue sandwich out of jackfruit. <laughs> Whoa. Jackfruit is a tropical fruit that originated from Southern India and Malaysia about two to 3,000 years ago. It's known as the bubblegum fruit because of its unique tropical taste that's a blend of banana, pineapple, and mango. Whoa. Jackfruits can weigh anywhere from 10 to 80 pounds. This bad boy is a 12 pounder. Jackfruit has a fleshy texture that is really similar to meat and is often used as a meat replacement in tacos and sandwiches. When ripe, it tastes sweet and can be used in smoothies. When unripe, jackfruit has a neutral taste and soaks in whatever flavor you give it. Some people claim that if you cook jackfruit in barbecue sauce just right, it tastes just like pulled pork and with a blind taste test, you can't tell the difference. Today I'm gonna show you how to make your own pulled pork barbecue sandwich out of jackfruit. First, here's the ingredient list that I used from Tasty. You can screenshot this and I'll link the recipe in the description below. For a meaty pulled pork texture, you wanna make sure the jackfruit is not ripe yet. The color should be between green and yellow. And when you press into the spikes gently, they should be medium firm and not too soft. When you smell it, the jackfruit should have a smell but not be too fragrant because that means it's ripe. Next, preheat your oven to 350 degrees and line your work surface with plastic wrap because the jackfruit is really sticky. Now coat your knife and the fruit exterior with cooking oil. Cut the jackfruit in half. It may take some sawing to cut through because the middle part can be pretty hard. Now take a whiff. Wow, it smells beautiful. Ooh. And imagine all the smells? vacations you're about to take, whether inside your mouth or actually via travel. Next, like cut the jackfruit into quarter slices. Shave off the hard core part from the top of each slice. Pull out all the fleshy pods and then there. pull out the seeds. Jackfruit has tendrils, which are the stringy fibrous part holding the pods in. Now put the pods in one bowl and the seeds in another. You can roast the jackfruit seeds later if you'd want to. Finally, rinse the fruit and dry. Add olive oil over medium heat in a large pan and then add onions and garlic and then cook them until they're translucent. Add the jackfruit pods, spices, vegan Worcestershire sauce, and liquid smoke. And as Bob Marley once said, yep. stir it up. Now add the vegetable stock, and once it starts to simmer, reduce the heat, cover it, and let it simmer for 45 minutes, or until the liquid is mostly absorbed and the fruit has broken down. Now spread the jackfruit on a prepared baking sheet, lightly oiled, and bake it for 75 minutes until the liquid has baked out and the jackfruit has a deeper brown color. Pour the vegan barbecue sauce all over that jackfruit and mix it in. Cook it in the oven for 15 minutes. Voila! Whoa. All right. Serve warm on those soft, fluffy whole wheat buns with that cold, crunchy vegan coleslaw. Because nothing mm. tastes good as being healthy. Will it taste like a pulled pork sandwich? Damn, that's good. Woo! Hmm. 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 The jackfruit with the tangy barbecue sauce. Ooh, and it does have that pork-like texture. It's not exactly like pork, but it's close. Pretty darn close. And then you got the cold slaw, giving it that crunch and the vinegar bouncing out the barbecue sauce with a toasted bun. Ooh, the crazy thing about it is it tastes so good and there's way less calories and way less fat than a pulled pork sandwich. Like, yeah, I mean, I might just eat this normally. It does take quite a while to prepare the jackfruit sandwich, but overall it's pretty, Darn good. If you're interested in trying something plant-based, things that are high fiber, high nutrition, very low calorie, very low fat, you might want to try this jackfruit pulled pork barbecue sandwich. Buns up. If you like this video, don't forget to click like, subscribe, and if you want to get notified when I create new videos like this, just click that bell to get notified. And don't forget that nothing tastes better than being healthy. Whoa!